All right, so finished. I had a, a half of a second helping. Lucy gave me a second helping. The thing was huge. Uh, but constructive criticism, you know, home home chefs and professional chefs, you know, we got to kind of, you know, some of the things that, you know, I, I would, well, first of all, uh, Lucy, the, the, uh, the, the original recipe didn't call for the taco season. That was your own. That was fantastic because that gave it enough of that uh, chili, chili powder and, uh, you know, the flavor, the taco seasonings that really needed it. Like you were saying, without it, it wouldn't have been half half as uh, flavorful. Um, anytime you could get fresh corn, definitely use fresh corn. Sometimes you could use a, a grilled corn. You know, if you have a a fire going or something like that, and you could toast off some corn, that would add a whole different complexity to it. Um, you know, um, you know, doing doing a, uh, a rotisserie chicken, or if you you know. You made your own grilled chicken and pulled that meat off of a, a wood grill. Say you would have a smoke, more smoky flavor to it. Um, excuse me, but also the bones, simmer them down. You know, use some of that chicken uh, stock that we already use, but fortify it a little bit more with the natural bones and give it a, another. Deep, it had enough flavor. It had plenty of flavor. It, it would give it a more deeper chicken. What's up, Yeti? Chicken flavor. Um, the other, the other thing I was thinking of is instead of flour tortillas, if say you were to use a corn tortilla, you would get more like a tamale pie lasagna. And uh, it, would, it would also give it a different texture. So I, I, I might sometime try it with a, uh, a corn tortilla. Uh, corn tortillas instead of the uh, flour tortillas. But magnifique. And again, you could use some hash green chilies or some... Uh, some other, you know, roasted chilies in there as, as you know, that, that's a good base to start and you can tweak it and make it your own. But Lucy was fantastic and thanks so much for having me over. One-on-one, uh, -on -one, we don't get a whole lot of, uh, enough one-on-one -on -one time and Rachel's down in Florida also and and uh, so, you know, well, you know, beautiful to spend the afternoon with you. Love you, baby. Love you. Peace. Love you.